What's up you guys, James Wedmore here with the Bartend for Profit system and today I'm going to teach you a trick that I like to call Tom Cruise's flip to pour. Uh, real simple and easy to trick to do. Uh, it, it made Tom Cruise famous when he when he uh, filmed the movie Cocktail back in 1988 I believe it was. It was about the only trick he could do uh, but he did it so much he could do it well. So I'm going to teach it to you right now. Very basic, easy maneuver that's just going to have all your guests with uh, eyes and mouths wide open as they watch you do it. Um, first of all, we're going to start with uh, a plastic flare bottle. Um, this, is, this is not glass. I practice all my tricks with, uh, with these practice flare bottles before I uh, ever do them behind a bar at a private event or a party um, with glass. So the reason for this is you don't want broken glass in your ice or in people's faces. Not good. Um, so always practice, practice first. Once you have it down, where I, I, I usually like to have a rule of thumb uh, 10 times. I can do it with a plastic before I go to the glass and feel comfort, comfortable doing it in front of people. So here we go. Let's get started with the flip to pour. Uh, very basic trick. We're going to start with our bottle in a regular grip. And uh, I'll go ahead and have a cocktail shaker in the other hand. You can use a glass, a plastic cup, anything that's going to catch the liquid. And we basically bring it up into the pour and then bring it out. Um, so I'll do that a few more times for you guys. You bring it up. I mean, you can, you can bring it way up there and bring it in. Have a little fun with it, just like that. Oh, that one I messed up. Okay, so we go really fast, like that. Okay, so here's how we're gonna do this trick. Um, I like to put it in my left hand for starters. So we'll turn around. And I'll show you how I'm gonna do that. In the standard grip uh, pour. It's all in the wrist, and you're going to flip the bottle to the outside like so. And what you're doing is you just let go when you bring it up and just leave your hand open like so. And the bottle will literally just land right in that. So watch here. And then you bring it into your cocktail shaker and pour it. So I'll do it one more time like that for you to see. Just like that. Okay. So when you have that down, um, if you obviously don't have a plastic bottle and you want to start trying right away, um, I suggest using a glass bottle. You can wrap it in duct tape. Don't put any water in there or any liquid in there yet. Get used to how it with empty. Um, and when you're ready, we go ahead and step up to the glass bottle. And I went ahead and put a little bit of liquid in there. It's just some water. I wouldn't waste any booze on this. But um, when you're doing a trick like this where you're flipping, you don't want to do any more than one fourth of the bottle uh, filled with your liquids, with your alcohol. So if you're going halfway or above, you're going to have liquor spilling everywhere. So don't do that. So when you're ready, um, also you want to use a pour spout just like this one if you can see that. Um, then you're all set. So usually towards the end of the night or something, you can start doing a fancy trick like that. But I'll show you with the liquid in. It's just as easy. And then we pour it in and swing it around. I'll do it for you one more time. Just like that. So that is the flip to pour trick. Um, from there, we can do all kinds of stuff. Uh, in my DVD section of the Bartender for Profit system, I've got a ton of tricks just like this. I'm going to have a ton more uh, posted on my blog at bartenderconfessions.com. So continue to check out and uh, see what else I can offer. Practice, 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 and uh, hope to see you out there. Cheers.